Hello, I'm Fritz Anderson. I had a glioblastoma that was initially treated by surgery, Temodar, and eventually an infusion of a modified viral uh, polio vaccine that was given to me directly into the tumor. This happened 18 months ago, and I'm happy to report that my tumor seems to have uh, basically uh, shrunk away. The last MRI I had at Duke University showed that the tumor was only a scar now, and it was basically no longer visible. Uh, that is, a, of course, great news for me and hopefully for the other 10 patients who received uh, this kind of treatment. The treatment is ongoing. They're still looking for patients uh, who are, have had a recurrent tumor after the initial chemo and radiation uh, and then will receive this, uh, this type of treatment. This recombinant uh, poliovirus vaccine uh, was developed initially at Stony Brook and then is now being uh, worked on by Dr. Matthias Gromeyer at Duke University. Uh, he has uh, modified the original poliovirus so that it now uh, opens the pores of the glioblastoma tumor and will uh, let the, uh, the uh, polio vaccine enter the tumor and open your tumor to the, your own immune system. So basically it's your immune system that is attacking the tumor. <clears throat> this is of course a big advantage since the tumor tends to diffusely enter the brain and you can never perfectly surgically remove the tumor since brain is like a gelatin type substance and the tumor uh, infiltrates this gelatin and cannot be removed totally. The information about the tumor treatment is available on the Duke uh, Robert Tisch Brain Cancer Center website and gives all the specifications exactly of what uh, type of patients they will accept for further treatment. Thank you. Good luck to everybody out there. Um, keep going. I know you have to, uh, you're going through a lot of uh, heartaches and treatment uh, worries, but if you uh, keep trying, you will find the right physician and university and treatment center for you as well. Thank you.